hello everyone welcome to your pedia education so today in this interaction i got uh, miss pratima who is pursuing her masters from nit raurkela so last year she you know travel or followed the process or her post gate guidance journey with your pedia education and we all know recently gate exam was concluded for most of the branches and all the branches and now in the coming time student will be looking forward to see the opportunity and admission chances for post graduate courses like ms mtech or pst with the premier institution so these interaction will give you deep insights and information and it will definitely help you all in deciding which college to choose and which specialization and you can directly get in touch with the views of your seniors and how they followed and what they choose when they were in the same situation as you are into right now so pratima first of all thanks for sparing few minutes and speak to us thank you so much for this opportunity sir okay so before we start ahead can you tell our student or viewers about your graduation journey from where you did it when you did it and what was your btech specialization and then your gate score or gate rank approximate rank if you forget the exact number and then currently which specialization you are pursuing and from where please yeah, uh, i'm shreerama pratima uh, I actually did my BTEC from CMR Technical Campus, affiliated to JNU University from Hyderabad. In I have uh, passed. I'm a 2021 passed out, and then uh, in 2023, I have qualified GATE, and uh, I got into NIT Roorkeela with a GATE rank of 5022 from general category. Now okay. I'm pursuing my MTech in. Uh, electronic systems and communication branch from electrical department okay that's good that's good so now if i talk about this specialization what all kind of opportunities master students are getting here in term of placement with this electronic system and communication are they eligible to sit for vlsi and communication companies or are they having some specific set of companies which are coming to recruit them and how basically they see the opportunity, how one see the opportunity who is willing to join this course. In this course, the curriculum is mostly like uh, around six, 50 to 60 percent more communication specified subjects uh, will be taught in this curriculum. Along with okay. that, we'll be uh, taught even uh, VLSI embedded also. But okay. here if a student can find he'll be open to any kind of uh, domain specific placements like he can jump even into the embedded profile digital profile analog profile or anyhow uh, okay. but we should personally work on particular domain along with academics okay fine great so can you tell me the stats uh, the people are getting good placement or can you quote me some number that uh, what amount of placement approximate and uh, what kind of company your seniors have gone from this specialization uh, the placement scenario is good in, in this uh, NIT Rorkela, sir. We can say okay. that around uh, 70 to 80% people are getting placed. Most okay. of them are getting the internships, but uh, recently because of the recession, uh, recession scenario, the conversion rate was a bit low compared to the previous years. But it's good. It's good compared to other, all other colleges. My seniors got placed in analog devices. Okay. Uh, and uh, Qualcomm. Okay. Micron. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Yeah. So as you told that uh, they got the internship opportunity. So what is the duration of internship? First, tell me that. And second thing, is it compulsory for all the students to go for internship or is it optional? It is optional, sir. It is purely a student's choice whether to take internship or uh, work for a project under the guide. Yeah, even though if we go for uh, internship, we need to parallelly work under the guide for project. Okay. So what is the duration of this internship? The duration of internship may vary from company to company, sir. It might be around six months to 11 months. Okay, six months to 11 months. Right, right, right. So all the specialization students are allowed to pursue the internship or some specific specializations are allowed? Till now, how much ever I know, everybody is eligible to go for internships. It 
it purely depends upon the guide under which you were a lot of okay pratima you know many time student are in confusion that uh, if i see the southern nit they come in the old league of the nit and top nit right so if he is getting new iit and old nit so they are in dilemma what to choose see everybody might be having a different perspective so if i ask from the placement point of view or some academic freedom point of view how is the culture in nit raurkela is it good and is it advisable that if some student is getting opportunity to join he should come there and he can get the roi after the masters <clears throat> uh can i ask what is roi means return on investment means whatever he is investing in terms of good placement i don't know i really don't have any idea about new iits but how much ever i know about old iits they are very good because they have very bit uh, very big links like uh, they can connect to the aluminies and all the aluminies are got settled in very good positions in very big big companies even in some of them are doing their P masters phd uh, in good iits like uh -huh. everywhere the connections are built already so right, it would right. be easy for a new student to get through that process okay fine truly 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 so <clears throat> as you see your gate credential they were also not that much very you know good and uh, exemplary right they were yeah. on an average and very you know as uh, might be you were not satisfied with your performance yes. also right and there will be many student in the same position right now because recently the gate exam is concluded so yes. you know the biggest uh, concern you can say or uh, you know kind of dilemma in the mind of student is that whether is it good that they join some campus with this gate score and which is feasible if you follow the entire process right and whether they should take one another drop so what is your personal take on this uh, sir in my opinion it purely depends on their individual perspective because if they have time in their life and if they can give another attempt like if they don't have any financial pressures and all I then they can take a chance because iits are definitely at some other par level i guess when compared to nits right right right, right. and even if whatever you might have got whatever they might have got some score uh, i just want to suggest them ki don't give up till the last round right right right, 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 right. i actually gave up in the third round i didn't go to the national spot round if i would okay. have gone there then today i might have been in nit suratkal okay right right, 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 right. i have seen people who got very much less score than mine yeah sorry right. my grade score is 397 sir 397 okay, okay. and people okay. who got a gate score of around 300 got into nit suratkal in the national spot round in the communication okay. event, which i would want right. it to choose right, so right 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 very true very true never right, right. give up till the last round that's it right 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 so pratima so it was a nice conversation with you also very informative and uh, you also put some well deep insights on the each question which i asked and i decided to choose the question which are the doubts of the student okay so that uh, you can speak from your own window campus window that this is the campus and this is what you're going to get here right okay. and i assume this is just a beginning of academic career for you also yes and uh, you team your pd education wish you all the best for your remaining uh, you know semesters i hope uh, you continue the efforts and uh, may you get a huge success in terms of the placement in some big mnc right thank yes. you thank you so much sir your pedia has helped me a lot in this process i never thought i could get into some college with that gate score but your pedia gave me motivation that you might get and finally i right, got right thank right right definitely and each one of those student can get who at least have qualified the gate right <laughs> Yes sir thank you so okay. much okay thank you thank you